Hello, Ready Readers. My name is Mrs. Best, and I am thrilled to be here with you this week as we have a week of learning, reading, and fun. So let's get started. If you're ready, say, I'm ready. Awesome job. Today, we will read a story called This and That. This and That. First, let's review our vowels. A vowel, we know, has two sounds. The long vowel says his name. So let's say our long vowel. A, E, I, O, U. But when a short, it has another sound. Let's say the short vowel sound. A, A, E, E, I, I, O, R, U, A. Consonants are letters that are not vowels. I have four consonants here today. Let's go over them. B, B. T, T, H, H, C, K. Now, when you have two letters that make one sound, we call those digraphs. This week, we're going to go over two digraphs. The T, H, th, th, no voice, but V, V, with voice, and the C, K. Our word here is th um, thumb. Can you give me a thumbs up? Good job. C K as in sock. Sock. Are you wearing socks today? Here are some more words with our T H sound. Let's read. This, that, they, path, thump. Let's read our CK words. Trick, smack, track. Notice anything about our CKs? Yes, they're at the end of the word. What about our TH? Nope, it can be at the beginning or at the end of a word. Great job. Well, today we're going to have several high frequency words in our story. I just chose four for us to look at today. R, down, from, the. R, down, from, the. Vocabulary words today, if you look at my picture, I guess you can tell what one of our characters are going to be. Our first vocabulary word is whiskers, whiskers. Can you look at the picture and point to the whiskers? Good, it's the hair coming out the cat's little cheeks. Another word is path, P path, path. Path is a way that you walk. So you made a path from your room to the kitchen, path. Our next word is skid, skid, skid. If you were running and you kind of slid, that's called a skid. Well, I think we're ready for our book. What do you think? If you're ready, say, I'm ready. Our book is called This and That. That is our title. It was written by Laura Appleton Smith 
and illustrated by Preston Neal. Do you remember what the author does? Right, writes the words and the illustrator draws the pictures. Good job. Let's read together. This and that are silly rats. They plan to trick the cats. This and that are making a plan. That the rat runs up to the cats. What are our cats doing? Hmm. Then he tugs on a whisker and runs fast. Wow. Tug to pull on a cat's whiskers. The cats jump up from their cat nap. They are set to hunt the rats. What do you think is going to happen? That runs fast. Then this drops a mop into the cat's path. Oh, look at this. Dropping that mop into the path. Smack, the mop stops the cats flat in their track. The cat skid down the steps. The rats are the best. Look at the rats celebrating. Oh, thump goes our cats. Is this the end of the fun? It is not. Run, rats, run. Okay. This and that run back to their nest. Mm, they're safe and sound. Yes, the rats are the best. Good job reading. We went over our digraph TH, but we saw some of the CK digraphs in there too. We had high frequency words and a lot of words that we could decode. So when you reread this book, I want you to look at this page and make sure you go over all of these words. We looked at some of them, but you look at all of them together. You did a great job, ready readers. Of course, we have some activities, practice pages for you to do. And a couple of pages, so it'll take you a few days maybe to get through them. If you don't have lined paper, it's okay. You can just use regular paper. But we want to go over the TH, like we heard in the word thumb and path. And you can draw a picture of a thumb or a path. We want to go over the vocabulary words like whiskers, tug and catnap. Can you tell somebody what those three words mean? And we're going to practice your handwriting, that uppercase T, lowercase h, and a lowercase t in an uppercase h. A little bit down, we want you to practice your sound boxes. Let's look at it. If I have the word path, how many letters do I have here? Right, four letters. But how many sounds are going to be in my word? Right, three sounds. P, A, S. T, H makes one sound, two letters, one sound. Path, that's how I'm going to write it in my box. Can you help me with the word that? That? How would I write that? In my sound box, I would have what? T-H, very good, makes one sound. At that. Awesome job, ready readers.
You have done an amazing job today, and I look forward to being with you tomorrow. Keep on reading. Bye-bye.